Wisdom can be like an old book. If it's not treasured, it's simply left to gather dust. Annabelle was quite happy to let old books be forgotten because, as she always said, there's nothing printed that's not on the net. If you could be bothered to read all these millions of pages, you'd be pretty interested in knowing what happens in the end. <laughs> And at the last fleeting moment, as the door would be closed forever, the Baron whispered, So tell me, how will Hansel and Gretel ever find their way out of the forest? <laughs> they won't have to, because their parents will know everything. You can forget about that pet rabbit you wanted. Annabelle! Rabbits are for babies anyway. You're banned from the computer for a week, and I'm taking that. You spend too much time on it anyway. You should be reading books or out enjoying nature. It's not fair. Why don't you just ground me while you're at it? No. I've got something much more productive for you. Are you kidding me? Your mum's been at me to clean out that shed for months. So, think of it as an opportunity for you to show us how much you care. Oh, by the way, disinfectants in the laundry when you're done, you might want to wash thoroughly. This is light. Whatever's back there, you'll cop the entire C volume of this encyclopedia if you try anything. Looks like Annabelle's made so much space out in the shed we can store more stuff in there. How's it looking? No, don't tell me. It'll be like a Christmas present I'll open when it's time. More yummies. You in here?
tired, I'm bored. What's news? Only something that'll make you cry for your mummy. And Mrs. Garrett will eat me alive. Give me a textbook. Just give me one. What do you hate the most? Take history. It's also out of date. <laughs> okay, ready? Come on. Okay. Don't move. Ready? Three, two, one. My arm's hurting. Of course it was me. I don't know what you were doing out there, but it certainly wasn't cleaning. I couldn't find a single one of our books. But you sterilised it so much, you could have wiped out entire habitats. You have no idea what could have been living in there. I know exactly what was living in my shed. You saw it? How? But... Can I keep him? What are you talking about silverfish why would you want to keep them hundreds and hundreds of tiny bugs oh it's disgusting dad i'm sorry i didn't do such a great job of the cleaning and i know it's wrong to tear page from library books but it was just a stupid prank See you in ancient history. Breadcrumbs. <laughs> All 
Although Annabelle would keep a watchful eye on her father's shed for years to come, the little creature with an appetite for words would never again appear. For thanks to Annabelle, it had now found a home where it would never grow hungry again. I heard you the first time. 